Fighter pilots consistently don a comprehensive helmet and mask ensemble throughout the entirety of each flight, a practice ingrained within military fighter aircraft operations. This stands in stark contrast to civilian aviation norms. The primary impetus behind the donning of masks is the imperative need for a sustained oxygen flow. The mask, a conduit of life-sustaining air, ensures an uninterrupted and pressurized delivery of oxygen air amalgam to the pilot. This function is especially critical at elevated altitudes where the act of breathing, as taken for granted at sea level, is compromised by the reduced partial air pressure. This physiological predicament emanates from the diminished capacity of the lungs to effectively assimilate oxygen, leading to an imbalance in oxygen intake, hypoxia. A condition characterized by insufficient oxygen levels in bodily tissues, hypoxia bears the potential to precipitate unconsciousness or even fatality. The mask's indispensability becomes pronounced as the altitude exceeds the 10,000-foot threshold, prompting its deployment for passengers in the event of cabin depressurization. A swift descent to an altitude below 10,000 feet follows suit in these contingencies, ensuring the passenger's safety and comfort. While both civilian and military aircraft adopt pressurization, the techniques and purposes diverge markedly. Military fighter aircraft employ dynamic pressurization, a system responsive to altitude fluctuations, in contrast to the static pressurization prevalent in commercial aviation. Due to their operational context involving higher altitudes and often intense G-forces, fighter aircraft mandate a consistent supply of oxygen at these elevations. The system, characterized by a regulated infusion of oxygen and air into the lungs, mitigates the physiological stresses imparted by the aircraft's performance. Integral to the helmet and mask ensemble is the integration of auxiliary equipment such as microphones, headphones, and communication interfaces, and assemblage pivotal for seamless and air and ground conversations. The coherent integration of these components is a deliberate design choice, minimizing distractions during the demanding task of piloting. The absence of viable alternatives further solidifies the aviator's commitment to retaining the unit in place, even during periods of inactivity. The ensemble's contributions transcend the realm of physiological support. It functions as an unwavering sentinel, steadfastly guarding the pilot against the exigencies of the cockpit. In the high-octane environment of the cockpit, this ensemble extends invaluable protection against the potentially injurious forces stemming from acceleration, abrupt maneuvers, and in the gravitational strains of high-speed flight. The visored, integral facet of the helmet stands as the sentinel for the pilot's eyes, shielding them from airborne debris and intense luminosity. Beyond the confines of the aircraft, the helmet mask amalgam continues its role as a safeguarding agent, especially in the event of ejection.